Hey YouTube, it's Jen. I thought I would do an overview of my lip gloss collection because lip gloss is fun. It's fun to wear, especially Bath & Body Works lip glosses because they smell and taste so great. So, this is my collection. There's one in here, well there's a couple in here that aren't Bath & Body Works, but they are my lip glosses, so I thought I'd include them anyway. So, let's get started. First off, Theo Bigelow Menthol Lip Tint in Ginger Mint. And I haven't opened this yet. I got a bunch of lip glosses at the semi-annual sale for like $2. So I'm kind of working through them and this will get opened up eventually because I'm really excited for this gold shimmer. I think it's beautiful. Next up is the Summer Vanilla Lemon Vanilla Lip Gloss. And I'm in love with this lip gloss. I wear it <laughs> probably more than anything right now. It's just a great, great gloss. Kind of smells like lemon cake again like the body care why Bath and Body Works did you just continue this scent I'll never know next up is Steel Vigilar Menthol Lip Shine in Berry Bellini and this is probably another one of my favorites because it has that nice berry summery scent but it also has that peppermint oil in there as well and I love that tingling and kind of nice taste you get when you absentmindedly lick your lips and it's just a nice clear gloss that goes over anything. Next up is Liplicious Tasty Lip Color in Fruit Punch. And I was actually very surprised at how pigmented this is. This adds quite a bit of color to my lips. And the scent just is exactly like Fruit Punch. That's what I love about Liplicious Lip Glosses. Their scents are true to their name. And you don't get that a lot. I really enjoy it. Next is another Liplicious lip Tasty Lip Color in Whipped Vanilla. This is just a really pretty dusty rose scent, scent um, color. And the Lip Vanilla is great. I really have found, come to find that I like the lip glosses with vanilla scents. I don't know why. It's not like I enjoy tasting my lip glosses, but for some reason, they've been my favorite. Next up is Forever Sunshine Lip Gloss. And this is another one I have yet to open, but I will eventually, um, mainly because I'm excited for the shimmer and I love Forever Sunshine, so this will be a fun one to do more in the summertime. Next up is the Liplicious Cupcake line. And this is in Cookies and Cream, and I had gotten this with a free lip item coupon, and it really does smell and taste like an Oreo. And the color is really subtle and pretty as well. It's not too glittery. I was a little worried looking at the packaging but it just adds a really nice shimmer and kind of almost a weird nude color to my lips. I don't know, it works really, really well. Next up, this is Victoria's Secret, not Bath & Body Works, but they're owned by the same company, so it doesn't really matter, but this is just Beauty Rush Lip Gloss in Sugar High. And you know, it smells great, but I really prefer Liplicious glosses, glosses better because Beauty Rush tend to be really incredibly sticky almost to the point where it's annoying to wear them. So, this hasn't gotten a lot of love. I think I got this as a gift. But, I do like just the clear sparkle, so it's nice to wear over lipstick. Next up is from NARS. And this is in Sheer Orgasm. And this came with a gift set I received from a friend. And I'm wearing it now, not that you could probably see it, but it's just a really pretty pink color, and I'm in love with this. There's not really any scent to it, which is fine because it doesn't need it. This stuff is great. If I had the money, I'd buy this in the full size. And then we have Liplicious Tasty Lip Color Sheer in Orange Kiss, another semi-annual sale gem. And I have yet to open this one. I Some of these I'm probably going to give as gifts, which is why they're not opened, but I'm still trying to decide which ones I want to keep and which ones I want to give away. Then we have Holiday Wine. This is the Liplicious Vanilla Be Noel. Again, with the vanilla lip glosses. I don't know why. Really liking them. This is just a clear sparkle, and it's really pretty. I found over red lipstick. I did this going out. I went to a holiday party at a bar, and I wore this over red lipstick, and I really liked the effect. It looked it was perfect for the holidays. So I'm going to experiment with other lipsticks and see how this goes. And then last but not least, this is probably my favorite lip gloss right now. Well, 
right now in rotation because I really like the vanilla one. But this is the Lipflicious Tasty Lip Color in Pink Grapefruit. And this is a really pretty, almost bubblegum pink. And the scent is so sharp and refreshing. It's, it's what I would want the Pink Grapefruit Classic to smell like. It's a little sharper than... And while pink grapefruit and body care is a little sweeter, I like that sharp, pungent, citrusy smell of, of grapefruit. And that's what I get in this gloss. So I am really, truly enjoying this. So that was my lip gloss collection. If you want me to review any of these glosses, let me know. This was just kind of an overview. I think I'm going to do this candle overview next because it's fun and these are kind of my favorite things. So, yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.